some days it feels like I'm running a, a junkyard in my house here, but uh, actually you'll see that this is not a bad find for about a hundred bucks. You know, it's like a 1987 snapper mower and uh, it starts right up. Alright, some other changes that have happened is my neighbor had that uh, oak tree right here. You might have seen this in my more winter videos, but uh, this thing, he had it caught down about two weeks ago. And now my yard has died completely because it no longer has any shade. Well, that and we haven't had any uh, rain in like two weeks either. So, no more shade. It's unbearably hot out here. Can't stand it. Um, what's going on here? Let's see. Ooh, these bright red things. I bought some new, um, brake drums for the rear axle. So I went and painted those up, cleaned them all up first. They're brand new. Um, cleaned all that, uh, I don't know what it was on there. Some, some kind of, uh, grease or whatever that was on it. I don't even know what it was. A Cosmillion or something. Anyway, cleaned all that off. Sanded down. Got some caliper paint and, uh, spray painted those. Um, today, I was on a little expedition over to Delaware. Um, today's my last day off. Um, today's my last day off for probably about eight weeks. Um, uh, took a trip over on the ferry over to Delaware. Uh, met up a guy at the, at the parking lot there at the ferry terminal. And purchased a bumper and four steel rims um, for this truck. So, I'll show you what I got here. So, rear bumper. This actually fits this truck. So I got that for about 75 bucks. Um, four steel rims that are in very good condition. Uh, these hubcaps didn't actually come on there. I purchased those somewhere else. Uh, these are the hubcaps that came with these rims. They're, they're destroyed. I don't want them. Um, they're going to go on the wall for yard art, I think. They're, they're steel. Um, anyway, so I got these these hubcaps which is the exact same one um but in much better condition i got these for about a hundred dollars um from a guy up in i don't know he was up up north in in new york so he mailed those down to me a couple weeks ago um anyway i got four rims that i'm gonna go get cleaned up and send off for i don't know yet power coating i don't know i don't know i don't even know if i want to do white or red i can't decide um bumper i'm gonna get that painted probably I'm thinking white or red don't know um drive shafts in the garage right now I'm working on that I pulled the springs apart um I'm actually going to take those up to a uh um spring shop and have them repack or re uh, bend them for I don't know like 250 bucks um I've got the new bushings I started taking them out but you know what since I'm bringing them to a spring shop I'll let them freaking take those out I'll put the new ones in but this is this is one of the old ones right there I'll pop that one out. Uh, it didn't really just come out that easy, actually. It was pretty difficult. Uh, other than that, I didn't get to painting the frame like I wanted to with the uh, um, that black paint that I bought I don't know, a couple weeks ago. I just didn't get around to it. Um, anyway, what I've done in the last few weeks is actually uh, complete college. Um, I didn't work on, on the truck a whole lot because... I decided to go ahead and finish off my last class to get my associate's degree, and let me tell you, that was not easy. It was a 200-level class, which is not that difficult. However, um, the amount of uh, papers I had to write, plus I was working, you know, nights. So my night would at work would start at 2 in the afternoon and run until almost 11 p.m., and, and uh, I was doing that six days a week, five, six days a week. So um, I would get a day off here and there, but I was spending that time writing uh, my research papers and doing forum posts and all kinds of crazy stuff for that school. So anyway, I've completed my goal of getting an associate's degree. It's just some general uh, general education, nothing serious. It was something I started about three years ago um, before I got got the whole cancer bullshit. And um, yeah, I put it on hold for almost a year because it couldn't couldn't do school at the same time I was doing uh, my job. So. 
anyway, progress is going to be on hold again because, like I said, tonight's like my last day off for a little while. I'm picking up a company um, Friday, actually. I'll be in the work tomorrow to start doing the preps. Friday, I'll be picking up about 113 young souls, and they're going to hate life for the next few weeks. So, um, you know what? we got to make new guardians somehow, right? New coasties, because I can't be doing this forever. So, anyway, here's the truck. Still in the same position. The rims are still there. I, I started up the truck the other day. Oh, yeah, this uh, rear differential. I haven't painted it yet, but I've already started doing some uh, um, work on there. So, I'm going to pop that off and... Um, set up my little blasting area over here so I can clean off some of that rust and start putting the, the paint on. I need to get something done in the next couple of days. But anyway, that's uh, that's all the progress I got for now. Have a good one.